please kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel, Arenga TV. Press the subscribe button and then make sure you turn on the notification bell, please. Hello, my wonderful people. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are across the world. Yeah, I remain your G, Arenga. Huh. Today is uh, 4th of May. 2020 yes and um, this is my first time of coming out after uh, five weeks locked down by the federal government and the state government however I've been home a week before the the lockdown by the government uh, so which makes it uh, six weeks today I want to go around to see you know uh, the situation of uh, the the country as in the environment you know to see you know the way people are coming out are they taking the precaution uh, measures that have been you know highlighted how to you know be taken let's just go around and see you know what exactly is happening in uh, society here in lagos just to know how they are fearing and also to you know it's not easy to just lock yourself in one place and not go out though i know it's for our own group but at the same time just have to you know put on the necessary things that you are supposed to do like i have here i have um, um some uh, is it fixed mask or no mask this was given to me it's like uh, uh, the, the the clothes that they use in uh, sewing this one and from what i can see I don't know if this will be that effective, but you just have to cover your your nose. And um, this, I have this one. This is uh, this one. I see. I discovered that some people they use it twice or more than, and they use it the old throughout the old day. I think this is being used by the doctors, and I don't think it's supposed to be used for long. And uh, some are even watching it, trying to watch it and <laughs> use it again. <laughs> let me hear your own view about it how you know like i said some people have started even uh, making their own face masks as well just to make sure that uh, they they keep themselves uh, safe and uh, to me i i always come out go out with a uh, handkerchief there's there's this thing i had that uh, a guy uh, wanted to buy face masks on the road and uh, he was trying to pick one while trying to pick one to buy he was he tested about five and he only picked one can you imagine that so we are not safe he, he wore five from this okay ah, no i don't like this he gave it back to the seller he, wore another, he gave it back to the seller then he only picked one then those ones that he has already picked what happened to it what happened to those ones so in fact we just have to be very careful I, to me, I want to believe coronavirus is not in Nigeria and it will not come to Nigeria. But this thing is real. We just have to be very, very cautious of whatever we do. Let's try our best possible to, you know, help ourselves. We are not helping the government. Let's help ourselves because we are the one now that will suffer it most. So instead of me putting on, if I don't have anything like that, I, I can just put on my uh what is it called use my my handkerchief just like this to me i'll just put it on like this tie it at the back so so i want to believe this is even safer for me because this is my handkerchief and when i get home i can you know watch i will wash it as soon as i get home it's easy you can if you want to put it down you can put it down like this and if you want to wear it, put it on like this. To me, I think this is the best for me here based on our own condition here because a lot of people take things for granted. So, and I don't want to fall a victim. Let me hear your own opinion concerning it.
Yeah, my people, I'm sure you've seen, you know, what the situation is in Lagos now. Though I can't be everywhere just from my place, you know, some other places around Ojota, K2, Ikosi, so which I know you have seen, you know, the situation on ground, what it looks like after lockdown. And uh, from what I can see, some some of our people, in fact, that social distancing is still, you know, they still don't understand it. And uh, many that are getting into the public buses, that distance is not there as from what you can see in the video. And uh, the Okada riders too that they've banned, you even see some carrying two passengers at the same time. You know, I, I think we all need to understand that this thing is for our own good. We need to keep social distancing while we are out so that we won't you know, contact this thing. We don't know who is who, we don't know who has this virus. So we just need to keep ourselves you know, safe. So however, there's this uh, uh, video that I saw on an uh, Insta blog, uh, Matt Latching, a family. In New York City, Corona is killing people like chicken. Oh, I'm your mother's sister's daughter. Some of them I don't even know. Some of you I don't know. Oh, sister, I hear they gave you guys money, 1,200. Oh, sister, I saw you on, online. That's why I sent you a message. That's why I decided to call you. Really? Obviously, your brain is at the back. You're not, you don't know what's going on in the world. America, is there a tree in America? Money tree? Enough of this rubbish. Yeah, I know it, it's not that easy. Uh, when you look at it, you know, um, though people in Nigeria or Africa, let me say, they see people living abroad in Europe, America or wherever, they see them as uh, people that, you know, uh, God has really blessed. And if you are to look at it, yes, God has really blessed those that are there, that are Africans. If you think that God has not blessed you, then you can swap your life with uh, your people in uh, Africa. Yeah, though some family are so annoying that they just keep on asking and keep on asking. They don't even want to know that you also, you are going through, you know, some challenges while you are there. Because uh, just like people say that the rich also cry, but they don't know, they don't care. Now that they pick phone, call. Sister, how are you doing? I hope you're fine. How is your daughter? No. Bring money, bring money, bring money as a baby. Yes, but that does not mean that you have to you know, go on social media and start not latching your family. Does it even sound well? Please, I'm not saying that you people are not facing this or that, you know, but at the same time, you don't have to go to that extent. If you are not in the shoes of those people, you won't know where it pinches. If they are okay, do you think they will come and be asking you for money? Thank God I'm blessed to have good family and friends all over. You are not even embarrassing them, you are embarrassing yourself. If you don't believe in God, if you are in America or Europe and you don't believe in God, or you don't believe that God exists or whatever, if you come to Nigeria, my sister, you will know that there is God. Why do you see churches all over the places? Because people, they believe that now that there is nothing, they don't have job, they don't they believe that, oh, they are, they, 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 there's a miracle. Miracle can come from church and with them going to church, they can get this, they can get that, they can... So then that is why you see everywhere flooded with churches, all the streets. Hey, le kure! Hey, le kure all of na! In Buhari's government, Bukbo in Buhari kore, hey, le kure! You are all criminals and thieves! You have some people also that live abroad and they are not happy with uh, what uh, you know uh, their families you know are going through in Nigeria so instead of them not latching their family they decided to also join their family to talk to the government to appeal to the government here in Canada they are giving people to they are giving money to people that stop work due to coronavirus and this uh, um, coronavirus issue how will they pay them they are paying them two thousand dollars monthly multiply it in nigeria money so even those that are paying tax they are not enjoying it they are not to enjoy anything they are not benefiting anything from the government he's paying me here these are the people that send us out of nigeria because they, 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 
you you you, you can strive. Except if you are if you are arm robber, if you are if you, except if you are using pen to steal. Thank you very much. Till I come your way same time. Next time with another video, I say bye bye and uh, oh drabo. Catch you. Stay safe. When you are looking for evil people, don't go far. When you are looking for agent of Lucifer, don't go far. When you are looking for selfish people, don't go far. And as Jehovah Almighty live it, all of you that that are in, in, in government, that you are living a comfortable life. You have everything at your disposal. Sadness shall end your lives in the mighty name of Jesus. How can you lie this, this kind of lies that is not even covered? You've spent over 100 billion naira to the poor people in Nigeria that could not feed. Where are they? How? Inshallah, be kudura to la ta'ala. Ola Mecca, Ola Medina. I'm not cursing. I'm just talking. All of you that share in this money and you came up with a lie. Inshallah. Inshallah. Kun fire kun. Amen. Amen. Ami subwana robi karobile sati wa mwa yasifun. Wa salamu alayhi wa salin. Alhamdulillah ya robi alamin. Because you are all going to die. Please kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel. Arenga TV. Press the subscribe button. And make sure you turn on the notification bell. Please.